Hi guys, what's up? In this tutorial we're gonna learn how to create dining table material like that. First I'm gonna show you my seeing what I have. I have three part it was created with box and maybe in the future I'm sharing with you the modeling but first I'm gonna create a materials first I have a simple V-Ray MTL and the texture this is my textures this is diffuse and the texture for reflection and normal map and some dirty texture you guys you can find in the internet it's total easy you can you can tape it in a google dirty textures so i'm gonna show you this is my first dirty texture i'm using the composite with two layers and combine it in the overlay options this is layer 2 it means this one and layer 1 and use it the another composite this is color correction actually in a color correction I did nothing but in composite again I have this two dirty textures using the color correction only I am um, uh, the gamma contrast change to one that two this is for first one and the second one just am um, using the monochrome in a composite in a, in a layer two it mean this one I'm combining with darkener, darken, and without change the opacity, and go to fraud. As I told you, this is color correction. Only I change it to gamma contrast to one point one and uh, actually in a second composite I have two layers in the first layer I have this combine until here and the layer two I have another dirty textures as I told you you guys you can find in it internet to tell simply you can search it dirty textures and the opacity for two layers is 100 but the, the, the dirty as a, a second layers I use it the overlay well this is my diffuse texture um, using the color correction the only I did it in a gamma gamma contrast and change it to all that nine because I want it a little bit darker you guys you can see here a little bit darker Again, I have 
color correction. Actually, I'm gonna use it. The gamma contrast one that maybe one. Well, the first color correction correction I'm using to diffuse. The second color correction I'm using for reflection at the instance and in normal map I'm gonna go to the V-Ray to maps V-Ray and V-Ray normal map drop to normal map and drop to bumpy This combined dirty texture, I'm gonna use it for glassiness at the instance. Well, the reflection, I'm gonna use it to 5 5. And in glassiness, I'm gonna use it then. Oh, that. Eight. So now I'm gonna go down to the option and sorry in the maps for reflection map I'm gonna use it 30% and for glassiness I want to use it 20% and in a bumping and I'm gonna use it at 10% whoa here's something we have to do in a furnace IOR I'm gonna unlock it and use it 1 that 8 and again lock it you guys you can See here we have a reflection, a little bit of reflection, but it's, and also in a glassiness mod. This is for our wood. You guys, you can see here, and a middle of two sides we have glass well in the, for this glass I'm gonna use it again the V-Ray MTL and a diffuse and change it to completely black and in a reflection completely reflect and in a glossiness I'm gonna use it all that eight and in a full color I'm gonna use it there fogging color whoa the first number one three three the second five six and the third one one five okay Selection the middle of and the two side. This is a wood. Right click, assign to selection. I'm gonna go to camera perspective and 
test render. Oh, sorry guys, something I have forgot to tell you. And uh, glossy material, I have to fog multiplayer change to all that seven. Again, check the fog color. render okay guys what I'm gonna do I'm gonna pause it this video for save our time okay guys this is the result of the rendering if you have any question let me know by comment below I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, I will see you in the next video.